So what exactly is the history of Hunts Rules and where did it all begin? Well, you see, I would say it began around 2015. 2015? Fifth grade? Yeah, good times. Anyway, basically, it all began with the thought of, well, it was mainly food at the time, but, you know, I was thinking about this brand of ketchup and it was called, it was called Hunts. You, you may know Hunts Ketchup. Yeah. Well, um, I was thinking about that, and I thought, you know, that would make a really cool YouTube name. And so I decided that, um, you know, that could be a YouTube name. I mean, obviously, this was just a thought, and the this was really when the concept of the channel, Hunts Reels, really began. Uh, this name would stick, though. You know, unlike other YouTube channels where... Some names don't really stick, or they end up being changed almost completely. Hunts Reels, for me, kind of stuck. Well, I should say Hunts, because at this time, I still called my channel and referred to it as Hunts. Now, that was pretty brief. Uh, I then changed it to Hunts Reels, and then I made the channel, and I made the channel with the name Hunts Reels, and that's how it's been ever since. But... What's the legacy of Hunts Reels? Like, where where did the channel begin, and how has it evolved, and what's the channel looking like now, and what will it look like in the future? Well, one thing I can say that's sure to come is probably better videos and better things, because, you know, I'm going to start taking editing and making videos more seriously now, because I do want to actually grow uh, a nice fan base and, you know, entertain my viewers and all that. Anyway, though, let's get on to the Lexi Hunts Reels and where it all began. So, on November 23rd, or 24th, whatever, we'll go with 24th, 2016, I officially made the channel Hunts Reels, and that was also the same day I made the Google account for my channel, because, you know, Google accounts. Anyway, so, I made the channel. The channel was made on November of 2016, that's all you need to know. So, yeah, also, almost three year anniversary, yeah, I'm gonna make a video on that. Anyway, so basically, that was when the channel was officially made, but, the thing is, I didn't really do anything when my channel first came out. I I was really excited, I posted a video, um, it, it's still there today, I haven't changed it because I feel like I should preserve my first video, you know, even though it's really bad and no one should watch it, but... Yeah, it was my first video, and it was uploaded, I believe, the same day that I made my YouTube channel. And you can actually go watch it if you want. Um, I might link it in the description. Anyway, after this, I figured, well, I'll go to bed. I'll make some other video, like, tomorrow. And I don't believe it was the next day when I made my second video, but, you know... 2016 was definitely not a prime time for my channel, I'll tell you that. There was a lot of discussion in the air uh, from my channel. Like, For me personally, it was like, what do I, what kind of YouTuber do I want to be? You know, What do I really want to achieve? And what do I want to accomplish, basically, in my YouTube channel? And 2017 was definitely a little bit of an uprising. In channel ideas because I you may not have noticed from my 2017 videos I threw a lot around uh, with like what I do on my channel like do I do plush videos do I do gaming videos do I do tutorial videos like what do I do you know I just do a mix of everything which I think personally that doesn't really display who I am as a person because if if I do, like, gaming videos, plush videos, and tutorial videos, I'm kind of all over the place, you know, I seem, like, less organized and just generally less, um, fit to do the things I want to do. I basically just seem all over the place, and that's not a good look for anyone. You really want to make sure that you get a clear message to your audience that you are or an organized YouTuber, and you organize your stuff, and then nice manner basically so what i'm trying to say is 
after 2017, I really tried to make sure that my, I organized my channel and make it suitable for all audiences while maintaining a specific kind of content that I do on my channel. And 2018, I tried to attempt this. Well, I attempted this, and I failed, kind of. I mean, I didn't really do much. And 2019 may have been that little phase when I kind of started to reform. I guess our 2019 still to be a pretty good, like, reformative year. And 2019 still not over yet, technically. We still have, like, what, two months before it's over. But, uh, yeah. I don't really know where the his where the history uh like how it'll affect me, especially like moving into the future with future videos that I haven't even thought of like what I'm gonna do for them yet. And I would also like to take this moment to apologize for me being very inconsistent with my videos. Um I know that that can be a bit of a problem, uh, and I'm sorry about that, but I will try and get videos out more consistently, and I will also try and have a regular stream schedule. Um, I can't guarantee that, obviously, with school and other things, but I will try, okay? Just believe that I can do it, and maybe I can do it. Uh, anyway, guys, it's about all I can really say for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this short little documentary of Hunts Reels. And uh, let me know in the comments below what I should do for my next video. Because honestly, I'm out of ideas. <laughs> and yes, that was Discord. My my friend's weird. Anyway, uh, yeah. See you guys next time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. You don't have to subscribe, but I'd appreciate it. Huh. Okay, I'll just end the video now.